What's up everybody, this is Spartan Grown, and this video is going to show you how to use the custom screen, which is the screen that we're on, on the Grandmaster LED controller, and uh, how you can run presets. See uh, here how it's grayed out right now, the preset screen, so we can go in there. I've been doing a little bit of work already. Um, when you first push this, you're only going to see one, one line, the very file one, and you have to have at least one in there. It won't let you, you can delete these all with the buttons here. But you have to always have at least one, it won't let you delete the final one. But you can modify it. So for file one, if you hit the modify button, which is right next to the delete button there, uh, you can set your slider bars to whatever you want to mix your spectrum. What this is doing is, is we're setting different spectrums as a preset that we can uh, then use to just come in here and then hit these buttons here to enable that spectrum. Now I'm going to enable that spectrum, or I want to enable that spectrum. All right. I got all these spectrums from the manual. And what I did, this is the Tarantula Voyager man manual, so it's only got the two the the two channels. So if I wanted to do spectrum one, which I matched it here, you don't have to do this. You can set the values whatever you want. If you do some experimentation and want a certain uh, secret spectrum, you can do that. You can set it in here. It'll be one, one of them for you to choose. So file one, you see it's got actually one through five the first channel is at a hundred percent and the only thing that changes is the second channel three and four is shut off because we're doing a voyage and we only do two channels on this example but if you were going to do a four channel you could put those values in three and four as well and get those for you um but if you like if you see here on five it was a hundred percent and fifty two percent is what i have my two channels set to and i'm just going off of the controller i went to five and the two that they say to set it to here is 152, just like I have it in the screen. Uh, same thing, you know, each spectrum, you'll get those values and you just transfer them in. And you'll be able to uh, use those spectrums. So, for example, if I wanted to run Spectrum 5 now, I just click there to hit the Spectrum 5 on. I say OK. And then uh, you make sure you go into your timer set and that your timer is set, right? I have a, an on and off for seven o'clock, seven a.m. to seven p.m. and turned on enabled. And that's how you run the preset spectrums, man. It's, it's not um, super difficult. You just gotta do a lot of work to, to plug them into here. Uh, but if you're only gonna use two, three, four spectrums, maybe, uh, maybe you're just gonna use two spectrums. Maybe you have a favorite veg spectrum and a favorite flower spectrum. You could put them both in there and when you're ready to flip, uh, you could just toggle the one on that you want and you're good to go. Now to add a spectrum, so you want to, you have a bunch that you can add, uh, all you do is hit the plus button over here, see? And then you slide it to whatever you want. So I'm gonna take the two channels off, and uh, this is for file number six, uh, which you could also change the name of that if you wanted to call it flower, or early flower, or late flower, or whatever you can imagine. You can call it whatever you want to. But I'm gonna leave it file six so that I could just match it up with here, number six. And uh, my values here is 172 for the two channels. So it's already at 100 up there. Bump that down to 72, it's 60 already. 67, 69, 72. And then I hit this button up here to save. And now I have a number six file that matches the manual. 100% on your warm white channel, 72% on your cool white channel. And that's how you have it. Now if I wanted to enable that spectrum I'd click the on button I'd say okay and there you go so if you're running the preset if this is lit up you're running the preset that's how you do it make sure your timer is set on and off fairly self-explanatory but if you want to run the customized screen you can still run the customized screen um, and, and that you just set your spectrum within the timer so you set your time and your spectrum all at the same time on this on this setting also enable or disable if you wanted to there. So either way you want to do it, you can do it with a uh, tarantula Voyager. This is set up for Voyager right now. Um, otherwise, I'd have all four here for the boy for the Borg. And that's just changing the system settings. If you want to change that, they toggle on and off here. All right. I hope I went over everything, and this helps helps you guys. Have a good day and keep on growing.